Hey guys, what is up? Techie Wiki here, back with another video. And in this video, I will be creating a like user info command, like to find all the info of a user and whatnot. So you need to create a new cog. Okay, so once you create a new cog, you want to like create the command at commands.command, and then you can add some aliases. I don't know if I've covered this or not, but like aliases are basically just like other words you can use for the command like in this case i'll do i'll do like who is or like ui for user info and then um async def user info self ctx and then for this you can do member is discord dot member equals none so basically what this means is that like oh member i didn't mean to do that member is like a member that you mention but if you don't mention a member it will just use you as the member so after that what you want to do you want to create a new um what's it called a new list called roles roles equals list and then if not member member equals ccx dot author this is like this will be easier this is just to make it easier for the rest of the code oh i forgot to put a colon and then and then for the we're also going to add uh like a roles list that's what this is for so you can do for role in member dot roles roles dot append string x dot mention oh not x i meant role dot mention so this is just adds the role mention to this list and then you also want to import date time heck no from date time import date time and then you do roles dot reverse which is reverse the list of roles. So they'll go from your highest role to your lowest role. And then you create your embed. Equals embed equals the discord embed title equals. Let me make this an F string. Like, let's say, um, member, members, user info. And then you can add a color if you want, but I'm not going to. And then embed dot add field. So you will add multiple embed fields. So let's go to the documents and let's just start discord dot member. And then you'll see all. Oh, then let's go here. And then you will see all the different attributes that are assigned to discord dot member like activities. The activities that the current usually user is currently doing, it will like show all the values to that, and then it was also like activity avatar avatar URL bot. This checks if they are a bot or not. Color, which is their color role. Color is just another synonym. Then created at like when they're created default avatar is like their default avatar, like what color it is. And then there's all this. The ones that we were going to use, we're going to use name, discriminator, ID, what time they created their Discord account, when did they join, and then what roles they have, their role color, and then their avatar. So let's start off with name equals username. And then value equals member.name. And you can just you do do that so you do shift alt down arrow to like create a new one so i did that a few times so now i can do you can change the discriminator discriminator and then this can be id number dot id and then for this one what we're going to do we're going to do created at and then for this, this is where like the date time comes in. So you need you will need to create once. So it's like value equals date time dot time. 
strf time is where it converts uh, like a date value to a string but then there's also strp time which converts a string to a date time value so in this case we're giving we're getting the date value converting it to a string so member dot created at and then colon and then this is like a bunch of syntax you go to strf time dot org strf time dot org this is basically like a cheat sheet for like what it is we are going to be using at a percentage a which is the date and then percentage b sunday september and then dash d which is eight and then y which is like the year 2013 so member dot created at comma and then you do a oh that's not the right a b dash d y basically what that will look like that will look like so today is the third monday january 3rd so that will look like monday january 3 2022 that is what it will look like so you do that and then you can just copy paste this and then put it as this value but you have to do oh, member dot joined at and then you just put it as joined at and then username for this we can put their like roles this is like a sort of challenging one so you do if if len string and then this is like you need to use dot join for this which is like so if you do len of string of the roles dot like if you join the roles with this like horizontal divider and if that if the length of that string is greater than 1024 then you write too many to display since the only amount that you can have in one embed field value is 1024 so if that dot join x oh x dot mention for x in member dot rules is greater than 1024 embed dot add field um roles and you do roles and then you will like say how many roles they have so roles and then len member dot roles and then make this an f string and then roles value will be too many to display but then you can do else else roles copy this actually and paste it and then value is basically just joining these roles with the like horizontal divider and then we can add the roll color embed oops embed embed add field name equals roll color and then value equals member dot color and then we will have their avatar as the like embed thumbnail, which is like the image at the top right of the embed. So embed dot add, oh no, set thumbnail URL equals member dot avatar URL. And then just await ctx dot send embed equals embed. Once we start the bot, what we can do 
is that we can run the command. What's the prefix? I forgot the prefix. Um, dot help. Okay, yes, dot help. Dot user info. So it will show my username, my discriminator, my ID, when I created my account, when I joined the server, or in my case, created the server, and then um, my roles that I have. This role is like basically the default role. It's like the add everyone role, which is why like everyone gets ping when you do add everyone. It's like a default role, and it shows my role color, which is E342DB. I don't know why I have that role, but I just do. I was testing it, I think. And then, yeah, that's basically it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you later.